Good morning, everyone. We are back. It's Katie and Jessica with the Bozier Chamber, and it's our weekly update. It's also National Polka Dot Day. Can you tell? Don't look really. it up. Don't look not it up. really. It's not. But we would like for it to be. So anyway, like I said, we're back to talk about our weekly updates, what's going on this week at the Bozier Chamber. So as a good partner, we are this week um, at the Shreveport Chambers hosting CC to DC and Lisa Johnson is there all week with appointments on the hill and making those um, meetings for you to talk about things that are going on here in our region and so we will be following that on Twitter along with the special session as it wraps up this week. Right. This week is a very uh, meeting heavy, event heavy week for us here at the Chamber. We will be out in the community uh, supporting our members, supporting you guys. Jessica, what events do we have? So the school board has a retreat um, tomorrow that we'll be at. The Bossier City Council meets tomorrow. We have the Bossier Bridge Police Jury on Wednesday. Yeah. Katie is going. Yeah, we have uh, the Inspiring Women's Week, uh, which is hosted by the Bossier Women's Commission. Mm -hmm. They had a breakfast last week, but this week is their big lunch. It's going to be at the Bossier City Civic Center on Wednesday. So we will be there uh, representing and supporting the uh, Bossier Women's Commission. Yes. Also, the Port of Caddo Bossier will have their annual appreciation dinner on Thursday. So we will also be at that uh, representing and supporting all these great partnerships that we have. And then back to chamber work on Friday, we have a ribbon cutting, an anniversary, right? Yeah, Roly Poly of Bossier City, they're having their one year anniversary ribbon cutting. So happy birthday Yay. to them. And there's one thing that we did leave out though, we have something uh, really important tomorrow on the base. So yes, so that. there's a um, manufacturing and law enforcement industry job fair that's on the base and that's put on by the TAPS program. So they're trying to do industry sectors um, in different quarters and so manufacturing and law enforcement will be tomorrow for those on the base who are separating, retiring, things like that. Um, if you want any more information about those job fairs, please contact Katie Holly here in our office at MRC at BossierChamber.com. Absolutely. So, yeah, what else do we have? Just that nothing much else this week, you yeah. know, just a few things. If you have it, if you want additional information, always check out our website calendar at BossierChamber.com. Uh, our next upcoming event will be on March the 15th. Yes. It's our public policy at breakfast with Camille Conway from Lobby. Right. So, so as the regular session starts on March 12th, we'll be getting an update on what we should expect from those lawmakers and banners. All right. So until next week. Thank you. Bye. <laughs>